This is Gabriel from BestGuitarEffects.com. I'm going to show you the TC Electronic Polytune 2. When you first power up the pedal, all the settings that are active will scroll across the display. We're in guitar needle mode, standard tuning, tune down to E flat, and with a 440 reference pitch. Let's tune up. All right, when you hit all the strings at once, you instantly go into polytune mode. Looks like a few strings need some work. When you hit one individually, uh, the pedal will immediately switch to the chosen strobe tuning mode or needle tuning mode, which is what I have it currently set to. Now I'm tuned down half a step, hitting the B string here, but it's showing up A sharp, which is the equivalent to B flat, half a step down. All right, looks like I'm pretty tuned up there. The way I was able to select uh, the down tuning modes, there's a button right on the back labeled tuning. Just push this, you can cycle through all the way down to B or you can uh, cycle up all the way up to the capo tuning modes, all the way up to B on the seventh fret. When you find the mode you want, just let go, and back in E flat, and good to go. To change the display mode from needle to strobe tuning, there's a display button on the back over here. You can scroll through the four different modes that are available. You have guitar needle, guitar strobe, bass needle, and bass strobe. So let's go to guitar strobe tuning real quick. And again, Strumming all the strings will let you see everything. Polytune mode, hitting a single note, brings you to the ultra precise strobe tuning mode. And you can see the strobe slightly swaying to the left there. It's a little bit flat. This gives you extra precision if you're pretty obsessive about your, your tuning. This is also very useful for um, setting the intonation of your guitar if you want to do it yourself instead of relying on a, a tech you know, or taking it to a shop or something. That's very helpful. So I always recommend doing the work yourself on your guitars and learning as much as you can about setting up your instrument. So this is a really cool uh, pedal for enabling you to do that yourself. All right, let's see here. Pretty in tune. All right, it's good. Um, you can also change the reference pitch by pushing the display and tuning buttons at once and then cycling through all the way down to 435 or a 445 hertz reference pitch. I'm going to leave it at 440. That's standard in most cases. And uh, let's see, you can also drop tune uh, to D by just pushing and holding the true bypass foot switch. It'll switch to drop D mode in just two seconds, so really quick. And the light will always indicate whether or not you're in D or standard. So when you turn off the pedal and you're not sure what you're in, when you turn it back on, it'll indicate D for drop D. Or it'll have just a little cluster of the four lights to show you that you're in standard tuning. And that's pretty much it. Uh, really easy to use. Pretty excellent tuner. It's very accurate in the strobe tuning mode. Very reliable. The polytune mode is pretty helpful just for getting a quick visual of which strings need some work. And it switches between wh whichever modes you have selected very quickly. So it's really useful here. Just make sure you're muting strings properly. And you'll have no problem. It's a fantastic pedal. Um, it also has a power output on the back for daisy chaining other pe pedals. Um, has a USB port in case TC Electronic releases any updates. And the new LEDs are very bright. Um, it has an ambient light sensor, which will change the brightness of the LEDs. So if you're playing outside during any day daytime gigs, um, the lights will get really bright accordingly so you can see outside. That's very helpful. And it dims a little bit when you're inside, so it's still really bright, but not overly bright. But uh, it's pretty fantastic. The TC Electronic Polytune 2. Check it out.